Hey guys, I'm Christina Tosi from Momofuku Milk Bar in New York City, and this is my ultimate sandwich. I'm making my favorite sandwich, which is on our menu at Milk Bar. It is a Cubano croissant. I am willing to try any sandwich as long as there is enough passion and personality behind it. The part that I think um, is the most clever and that I would take home and spread on toast if I didn't have the entire Cubano croissant with me is our pickle butter. And it's the starting point of the Cubano croissant. It's super easy to make. It's um, unsalted European style butter and some relish. Basically looking at pickle butter. So you just scrape the pickle butter out of your bowl. We use a piece of parchment, wax paper, just something that's non-stick. Give it a nice little punch down, and you're really just going for a nice rectangle shape. We refrigerate the pickle butter for about 30 minutes, just till it's nice and rock hard. I don't do the straightforward sandwich. For me, it's about the sort of sneak attack of getting a croissant, thinking that you're just getting something average or ordinary, and sort of having the ultimate sandwich sneak up on you. The meaty part of the Cubana croissant starts with a pork shoulder. We actually create a very simple rub. We start with kosher salt, light brown sugar, some granulated sugar, freshly ground black pepper. Take about half of that rub and you're literally just pouring it over and giving that pork shoulder a really good rub down. So we take that other half and rub it on top. Remember, you want the fat top up. I like to put a little splash of water in the bottom of the pan. It's going in 220 degrees, no less than six hours, no more than 12 hours, but you got plenty of time in between to get plenty of your errands done while you wait for your pork shoulder to cook. But once it's cooled down to the touch, we're gonna shred it. We're gonna add Cuban marinade, orange juice, lemon juice, garlic, dill relish, some cumin and some oregano. And so we throw that marinade in with the shredded pork and you just toss it around. So we take that pork and we're gonna get the croissant dough ready for it. To make the dough element of the uh, Cubano croissant, it's super simple. We start with something that we call our mother dough at Milk Bar. You start with some high gluten bread flour, kosher salt. After the salt, we add a little dry active yeast and then some water and we just stream it into the dough. Seven minutes is your target time for kneading your dough so that you can really maximize the development of those gluten strands. And once you have the dough mixed, you need to let it rest and rise. And we're gonna start rolling out the dough. You're going for a nice even roll. I take my pickle butter out of the fridge and I plop it down onto the croissant dough. You're just gonna pull up the ends of the dough just to seal it in. We are gonna roll out this croissant dough to the same length, about eight inches by eight inches, which is twice the length of your butter pad. We're gonna roll it out three separate times, and each time we're going to fold layers of dough into themselves. And we're gonna roll it out one last time. We're gonna roll it much larger than the other turns. We are going to cut the dough into triangles. And then from these triangles, we usually cut a little notch. Super easy assembly. You take some yellow mustard and you do what we call a schmear. We usually put down two slices of that deli ham and then a nice ball of your marinated, tossed, and shredded pork. And then we put another piece of ham on top, just so there's a nice even distribution of all the ingredients as we go. You don't just want one perfect bite of an entire croissant, you want it to be perfect every bite through. That's what makes it the ultimate sandwich. Now we're gonna roll it up. So we're gonna wrap this tray very loosely in plastic and we're gonna let these croissants rise for about 45 minutes. 
we're going to throw them in a 375 degree oven for 20 to 25 minutes. The Cubano croissant is the ultimate sandwich for breakfast, lunch, or dinner. I feel like I would prefer to have a nice cold beer, but in the morning I would probably be fine with a cup of coffee and an egg on top of my Cubano croissant. <laughs> Look at it. Perfect, flaky, nice and meaty, nice and mustardy. Woo! It's the real deal right here. This is the Milk Bar Cubano Croissant. It's my ultimate sandwich. For more ultimate sandwiches, click here to subscribe. You don't have to go to Minneapolis to get a taste of Juicy Lucy. Just watch Richard Blaze and you can learn how to make one yourself. Pizza just got even easier to eat. Learn to make the best pizza Pop-Tart you'll ever have right here. You've played beer pong and maybe even bong pong, but you haven't lived until you've tried Octopong. See this live octopus challenge now. Because there aren't already enough uses for corn, why not try corn fungus? Check out what happens when The Office digs in. Subscribe for more free tasted treats.